Maurice, great to see you. What we're releasing today is our naval shipbuilding plan. This is a plan for jobs, it's a plan for security, it is a plan for the opportunity that investment in our defence industry brings, not just today and tomorrow, but for generations to come. Normally be staffed by a minimum of four people. This is the largest investment in our defence capability of our Navy ever in peacetime. Starting with a plan to, to acquire 12 regionally superior submarines, a process which will uh, be undergone here at Osborne to develop 12 offshore patrol vessels and nine future frigates. This is the essential basis of the development of naval capability that we have been working towards. Kicking goals, Stephen. Yes. As this plan sets out, this $89 billion investment in the capability of the Royal Australian Navy will secure the thousands of jobs of the most advanced type in manufacturing, in technology, in software, in construction, every category of skill at the cutting edge in every respect is going to be required here at Osborne. This is a hundred year project. This is going to be employing thousands and thousands of Australians at least 5,000 by the mid-2020s, but thousands more for decades into the future as we deliver offshore patrol vessels, future frigates and submarines and then sustain those uh, in both here and in Henderson for decades into the future. All of these platforms are absolutely at the cutting edge of technology, just as the air warfare destroyers are today. We are continually pushing the envelope because we need to do that in a competitive world to keep Australia secure. Thank you.